to it again? I play Birdie Fishburne, the fictional daughter of Lawrence Fishburne that I created because I love Lawrence Fishburne. And I also thought it would be funny to, the idea of playing like a celebrity kid, although I have no idea what that would be like, I thought it would be funny to sort of like heighten that idea and make it completely ridiculous if this girl didn't want to take the advice of her father and just went out there to try to be an actress randomly and just did ridiculous things trying to make it. And that's who Birdie Fishburne is, just the person who does ridiculous things to try to make it as an actress. And I play uh, Ryan Carrillo, who has a bit of an identity crisis. Uh, he's ethnically ambiguous. He's, never, he's not white enough, not Spanish enough, not Persian enough, so he really doesn't fit in anywhere. And so his whole thing is he's really trying to find his place in Hollywood. Uh, For those who don't know much about the show, tell them a little bit about Not So Union. Not So Union is about the most famous LA acting intensive um, and the, the bond that happens between six friends taking this class. Uh, coming to a channel like YouTube is because it's a huge, broad audience um, that you, you could reach people on their iPad, on their iPhone, um, on their Apple TV. And it's just a way where there's... We get to create our yeah. own content without yeah. somebody telling us what to do. Like, we get yeah. to say, oh, we want that. No one has to say, oh, her skirt's too short, or, oh, we don't want her saying that line. It's like, we're the boss. If she has to say the line, yeah, she has a, to say yeah. the line. A lot of uh, creative, freedom. creative freedom. And it happens to be like a new landscape. A lot of people are launching shows on, online. The show is called Not So Union. How important do you think unions are nowadays? Or how unimportant do you think unions are in this industry? I think unions are absolutely important in the way they make sure actors are paid fairly and they're not working over 12 hours. Um, and so, what we're, but what we're doing is, you know, talking about the, the process before being a SAG eligible member. And uh, there's just so much more actor strife and so many more problems before that. Yeah, it's such a difference. I mean, the stuff people can get away with when you're not in the union is like, I mean, it's funnier because you put yourself in situations because you want to be in the union. Yeah, like so. I have friends that do a non-union commercial and they air a million times and, they no and they're not being protected. So that's an issue that needs to be addressed. But, you know, we're actors, we need to work. How important do you think a channel like YouTube is in moving the industry forward? Um, it's, YouTube is very important in moving the in, uh, industry forward because it allows actors who otherwise would have a hard time selling a script or an idea to put their stories online and so many more people can watch it. Like who knows if Judd Apatow happens to happens upon a YouTube video or Gabe Sachs or, or a network, you know, yeah. who knows if a network comes and looks at it and says, Oh, you know, we'd like to take this because we have so many episodes that we can write that we could really do it anywhere. It really taps into people's potential, like Broad City, uh, all these high maintenance, all these amazing web series. And uh, there's just yeah, a lot of creative freedom.